Yo, what's up, guys? Zachos here. Before the video starts, I just want to let you know that I have key tags now. On one side, it says Zachos, and on the other side, it says God made wheelie, so I won't always speed. If you enjoy that message, if you'd like to wrap that on your motherfucking motorcycle keychain or whatever keychain you want to wrap it on, or maybe you just want to like hang it up on your wall and look at it because it's so pretty. If you want to get that shit, it's in the bio, so there it is. Blah, blah, blah. Enjoy the video. One more thing, I also have stickers on ian187.com that will be linked in the bio as well. Hit me up. Blah, blah, blah. So, guys, the first night I came into the campsite, by the way, guys, this week has been fucking awesome. Like, shout out to everybody I met because I met so many awesome people and like got to know people a lot more. I came down, what did I do the first night? I slept in and then the next day I, I met up with some of my friends. One of them had a boat, so I was chilling with them. I slept on their boat two nights. <laughs> that was super chill. I was chilling with him, his sister, their friends. We went to the beach and I came back to the campground. I met some really cool people. I went to the campground and of course like not every day you see somebody on this bike. Around the campground the speed limit 10 miles around so I wasn't even wearing a helmet. I was wearing a fucking snapback and sunglasses feeling like a straight fucking G. I'm a gangster. I'm a straight up G. The gangster life is the life for me. Shooting people by day, selling drugs by night. I walk around town with a stark erection, then gave your mom a yeast infection. Pulled up to the pavilion, which is where like all the like the locals hang out, I guess, because this campground, there's like seasonals, and then there's people who just wait. Like there's people who have like their camper there like all season long, and then they just come there like every weekend or so. They came up, I talked to them, and then like eventually it got to, I forget what happened. I think one of them asked for my Instagram. I gave them my Instagram, and they're like, oh my God, like, I mean, I have a decent amount of followers on Instagram, you know, more than an average person. Then it got to YouTube. Next thing I know, everywhere I fucking go on the campground, yo, Zap, what's up? It's like, I don't remember meeting you, but, What's up? Like, <laughs> oh god. Another thing is, if you met me this week, you probably know I'm shitty with names. I'm horrible with names. Just because of like my fucking concussions and shit, it's it's pretty fucked, dude. That's pretty fucked. You know, I kind of get lonely on these rides back. I'm just really glad I have Whitney right here. Whitney is the goddess of wheelies. The only reason her name is Whitney is because there's a because wheelie starts with a W. If any of you guys have a better idea other than Whitney. Maybe wheelie girl, wheelie girl, like hula girl, wheelie girl, wula, wula. I'm just, just not anything like offensive or vulgar. And then we'll be Gucci. I have officially broken in the Z. The Z is now completely broken in. It's got a 1,024 miles on it. You know, <laughs> so I've been putting miles on this bitch lately. I've drove it all the way down here, so that's like over 100 miles. The boardwalk, um, I didn't really know, because I was hanging out with, with this one friend that I knew kind of. He was actually in one of my videos back, in one of the snowboarding videos. Stark erection, then gave your mom a yeast infection. I was hanging out with him, and um, we were chilling on the boardwalk, and I was kind of hanging out with his friend group. A lot of them, I met a lot of them, all, everyone was nice there. But one thing we did is we'd be like, we'd be walking in a group, and I'd see another group of people, and I'd think of the most basic name, like John, Adam, or Steve, or some shit. I'd just yell it, like, yo, like, acting like I knew someone. And what the first time I tried it, like, without, like, it just popped in my head. Three seconds later, I tried it. I was like, yo, Steve. He was like, yo, what's up, man? I was like, yo, bro, what's up? I haven't seen you in forever. He's like, oh, yeah, man, how you doing? And, like, I started, like, just like, and I was like, do I know you? I was like, no, we, like, we don't know each other. And then we just started, like, be like, oh, like, I went to their group. I was like, oh, how are you? How are you? <laughs> Like, I just think it's the funniest, funniest shit to do. If you're with me in public, like, I hope you don't get embarrassed easily. I like having fun. I like meeting people. I like being that guy. Well, I don't like being that guy, but just kind of like the way that I live life is I am that guy, if that makes any sense at all. Oh, I just remembered the story I was gonna tell for this video. Okay, so in my campground, I told you guys, the speed limit is 10 miles an hour all around, and you have to drive safely because there's a ton of kids on scooters, bicycles, you know, the whole shebang. I feel bad for this guy, I'm gonna let you pass. <laughs> they didn't even care, they were murdering the bike. First day I was there, I was doing some wheelies, I wasn't doing any shit crazy. It's because that night, when I met a ton of the locals or whatever, seasonals, we went to the basketball courts, and that's kind of like the chill spot, the pavilion, the basketball courts, the lake, the pool, you know, all that, there's places to see people. At the basketball courts, there's this really wide road, actually probably about as wide as this, but there isn't like, 
anything around it, I guess. It's kind of just the way to the basketball courts. So I was doing wheelies up and down because all the kids wanted to see some fucking wheelies. And hey, if you were to see a wheelie, I'm going to do a fucking wheelie. Usually. <laughs> that's gotten me in trouble quite a few times. God, I've gotten, I've gotten a ticket like that before. But that's because I kind of did one in the middle of town. And that was just my fault. <laughs> These girls wanted to see a wheelie. I was like, like I'm going to do a wheelie. Like, who am I not to do a wheelie? Anyway, I already have an entire video on that. I'll link that in the description if you haven't seen that already. I'm doing wheelies, and, and uh, after I'm done these wheelies, I guess someone called and complained. I don't really know what they were complaining about, because like when I'm doing shit in there, I'm making sure there's no kids that are gonna run out in front of me. I'm making sure there's no cracks in the road so I don't need shit. I'm, I'm very good with rear brake control on this bike when I do wheelies now, so I wasn't really worried about looping it too much. I'm doing these wheelies, and we're at the point now where it's like, I'm done wheelies, and now I'm just giving people rides around. I think I get, gave like a few girls like just kind of ride around the block. They're like, oh my god, I want a ride. I'm like, oh my god, you can get a ride. And I get maybe 50 feet with this person on the back, not even, maybe 30 feet. And their security comes up, and she's like, fuck this. I get all, I stop, but she just fucking runs into the crowd. The guy comes up to me, he's like, hey, we got calls about you doing wheelies. Like, what's up with that? I was like, oh yeah, I mean, like I'm doing, like I they want to see some wheelies, so I'm. So I did some wheelies, and uh, he's like, oh, we can't be doing that. I don't want to be calling the fucking ambulance when uh, when you crack your head open, because I wasn't wearing a helmet. And it was like, and I was kind of like, I was like, all right, I understand. But like, what I wanted to say was like, listen, like, I'm doing wheelies, and I'm at the point, if I eat shit, I'm the only one that's going to get fucked up. I'm not going to run into anyone else. I'm in control. If I bust my ass, I'm going to do it controllably. You know, so if you call the ambulance for me, the only thing that's coming out of your day is a phone call and waiting for them to show up. Like, if I bust my ass, that's all me, you know? I didn't say that to him just because, like, I kind of out of respect. Just kind of like I didn't want to be like, oh, blah, blah, which I kind of was, I kind of wasn't. But anyway, he's like, oh, let me see your driver's license. And I was like, keep in mind, we are in a private property. And, like, I was like, I was like, no, like, I'm not giving you my driver's license. I don't know why I said this. Looking back on it, I probably should have just given it to him. But I was like, bro, like, I'm not gonna give you my driver's license. He was like, bro, like, just give it to me. I'm like, I'm like, I'm, we aren't on the roads or whatever. And eventually, like, after back up I'm like, fine. Like, he's like, I'm gonna call the cops and do this shit. I was like, bro, okay, here's my fucking driver's license. You happy? I gave it to him. He's like, okay. He's like, no more wheelies. And I was like, okay, I won't do any more wheelies. I'm sorry, riding around. I'm not doing wheelies. Or by the lake, and there's this huge fucking straight road right by that. There's all these cars that are waiting because of me. There's a ton of um, a ton of car. There's a ton of people at the lake, and I heard my sister was talking to people, and she fucking my shout out to my sister though. She's always like, like oh, sub subscribe to my brother. That goes. Look at all these people I just held up. These are all from me going really fucking slow. Anyway, so she was telling people, and then she got people yelling, Zach goes, do a wheelie, do a wheelie, do a wheelie. And I was like, okay, I did a wheelie, and it, I, I, it was kind of a shitty wheelie. I chased the fucking wheelie out. I chased the wheelie out, so I'm going maybe like 25 in it. Keep in mind, this is a 10 mile an hour. And there was security right there. He came up to me, he was like, yo, what are you doing? And it was a different guy, but I guess he had heard about me. He's like, come on, man, like, give me a break. Like, stop doing wheelies. Like, this is your last warning, blah, blah, blah. And then immediately after that happened, the head life, or I was talking to the head lifeguard. His name was Tyler. Shout out to you, Tyler. Hope I don't get you in trouble because I said your name in this video. He comes up to me. He's like, oh, that's Bill. Don't fucking listen to Bill. Like, he won't do shit because he was telling me he was going to ban my bike from the campground. He's like, bruh, just don't do, go, just don't do it too fast. Do the wheelies. Just fuck Bill. Like, whatever. He didn't say, okay, maybe he was to, like, fuck Bill, but he was like, listen, he can do shit. And I was like, okay, like, after I got the go-to the go from the head lifeguard, I was like, all right, sounds good. So that entire day, I'm just popping wheelies everywhere I go. I met some kids, I, I even have a vlog of this. And I met these two girls, one of them was the lifeguard there, and one of them was like a friend who was visiting their friend, I guess. And I was talking to them, I hung out with them after the people I knew, I slept on their boat. After they left, I hung out with them because I just had nothing to do. Because I was like, oh, I'm bored and like every, and this was like in the middle of the week. So a lot of the people were back at their house. They weren't at the campsite. I'm chilling with them and 
I'm talking to her about it. She's like, oh yeah, Bill, fuck that guy. Like, okay, okay. So like, I now have multiple people telling me just to like, just do wheelies everywhere. Like, no gives a shit. But then again, these were lifeguards and not head security. So they didn't have any say. And if you guys are watching like security or whatever, like don't give your lifeguards a hard time. I probably should have known not to do wheelies. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna pull over and let my bike cool down a little bit. Or I'm gonna stop and get something to drink the next spot, cause it is fucking hot right now. I just, God, I am stupid as shit. Hey guys, if you're wondering where your Christmas trees come from, they all come from this exact garden. Like, this is where all the Christmas trees from around the world. These sound for sale. This is a pretty chill road to go on. Really chill, right? I'm on a boat, motherfucker. So I talked to a bunch of lifeguards, I'm doing wheelies everywhere. And this time, I spent maybe like 10, 15 minutes, I was literally doing wheelies everywhere I go. I had like so many people fucking, all, so many cameras like, yo, do a wheelie. I was like, all right. So I did a wheelie. So many people asked, I'm making people smile, I'm having a good time. And then, I, there's this certain loop where like, there's a lake, a fishing lake in the middle, and there's a road that goes this way and around. And there was kids right here and they told me to do a wheelie. So I did a wheelie this way and I saw security behind me. So I'm locked in right here. They're waiting here for me. And I turn my bike off and I wait. I'm waiting for one of the, their golf carts to come up so I can go around the other way and just fucking book it back to my campsite. And I see a golf cart come up and I hear them say, wait, wait. I was like, fuck that shit. I booked that shit. And I come up and I see the, uh, I see another security guard. I'm like, fuck, like I, what am I gonna do? Like fucking, like fucking golf cart chase through the fucking, I'm not gonna do that. So he was like, hey, come back to your campsite. I'm talking to your parents. And I was like, uh, oh uh, shit. Like, and I knew my mom wouldn't care that much because she knows I'm doing wheelie. She knows that shit. I pull up to my campsite and he's about to talk to my mom. I'll finish this story after I wait my bike, wait for my bike to cool down a little bit. I'm gonna wait for this car to pass and then I'm gonna do a stoppy after I run into all this gravel, ready? I'm getting pretty good at stoppies too. I knew my bike was gonna get hot, so smart fucking Zach that I am. Shout out to this backpack. This was my kindergarten backpack, and it is the perfect riding backpack. I just don't look like the coolest with it, but I don't give a shit. Damn. Whip Maserati, skirt, skirt, skirt. All right guys, I'm back on the bike. It's cooled down to my liking. But anyway, so this guy comes up to uh, comes up to the campsite, and my mom is on the phone right now, and she's like obviously on a business phone call. And as he's doing that, I'm just paying no attention to him. I'm like going in the camper, looking for my fucking GoPro because I'm trying to record the situation. I'm like, I got my GoPro, but there's no the battery's dead in it. God, there's shit in my eye. I'm wearing sunglasses. Though. Okay, we're good now. But uh, I just come back from a fucking vlog. Like I I was doing I was doing the video. And then my camera died, so I put it back. And then I went out and did wheelies, and this is when this happened. Flags. I, guess, I don't know. Okay, people are just selling flags. I guess that's cool. So he comes back, and I'm looking for fucking GoPro batteries, but I cannot find them for the life of me. And uh, eventually, like, my mom gets off the phone. She's like, Hold or no, she's FaceTiming with my grandpa. That's what she's doing. And um, so my grandpa was on FaceTime when this happened. He comes up, he's like, oh, he's doing wheelies everywhere. I already told him I was gonna warm him. He's like, this fucking, uh, this bike is banned from the campground. You can go in and you can go out, but you can't ride it around. Just because like, he told me not to do wheelies before, which I probably should have listened to him, but it was like, the life bars were telling me not to listen to the, I don't, guys, it's, it's a whole, whole thing, whole thing. But anyway, so we talked to him for probably about five minutes, five, 10 minutes. And eventually we got to the, we got to the point where it was like, all right, I won't, we got to the point where like he didn't ban the bike from the campsite, but he said, I'm allowed to ride it around, but be very cautious and absolutely no more wheelies. And I was like, okay, like <laughs> no problem here. Won't do any more fucking wheelies. And I was kind of bummed out because you know, I wanted to do wheelies, but I mean, it's whatever. Riding bikes are fun, wheelies are funner. And he was threatening to take the, take the bike and park it up front, which I wouldn't, there's no way I wouldn't hell I would have let that happen. Like if I were to do wheelies again and got caught, I probably would have just been like, he'd be like, I'm taking the bike out. I'd be like, no you aren't, fuck off. Like I put it in wheel lock and fucking chain it to my camera. I'd be like, yep, what are you fucking gonna do now? You fucking bitch boy. 